Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. If you have really dirty and filthy headlights and you can't get them clean, they're all like dirty and just like like sandblasted to death, I'm gonna show you how to clean it with Mother's Polish and Chrome Cleaner. Let's get to the video. This thing is fantastic. Let's go. Hey gang, thanks for tuning into your review channel. So yes, I saw a video online and I want to test it out for myself. This is Mother's uh, Mag and Aluminum Polish. So what they're saying online is that if you polish your headlights and they get really kind of foggy and dirty, this one isn't terrible, but it is starting to build up now. It's starting to get really dirty uh, inside, it's starting to pit. And so what happens over time, this will get all hazed over really, really bad. Uh, and they're saying you use this and it gets it out. So we're gonna test, test it out. I'm gonna leave a link down below where you can get this. This is like, I don't know, like five or seven bucks, really cheap. Um, you don't have to go to the expensive place, heavy light, light lens change. You don't have to do any of that stuff here. I'm gonna try this out. So we're gonna go through it together. Um, we're gonna clean it. We're gonna try this out and we're gonna see if it gets some of this scuff mark out here. I don't know if you can see it, but you can see a little bit here, the haze in here. That's all from just driving the car and just getting dirty and then all this that the sand hits and basically like sandblast this when you drive the car. And this is plastic. Uh, so over time it just gets more foggy and foggy and before you know it, you can't even get a sticker anymore or inspection because it blocks some of the light and you can't see. So we're gonna try the mother's uh, mag and aluminum polish um, and post to work. All right, so let's get to it. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Appreciate it as always. Hit that notification bell. You'll be notified when the next video is ready as always. And I appreciate your time and let's get to it. All right, gang. So what we need here is some Windex, um, paper towel, and we're going to spray the plastic lens just to get some of the dirt and the residue off. Uh, and then we're going to use the, a, a clean rag and the Mother's uh, Mag and Polish Cream. And let's get to it. Let's go. Okay, guys. So we're going to take some of the Windex. Just spray it on here. One second. Let's spray. We got a paper towel. And we'll just clean the glass. That's the first thing you want to do. Just get it clean. And you can see that it's really foggy and dirty. Uh, so it's really, it's not awful, but it's really in there pretty good. Just a little bit more. And we're going to clean this whole glass. Basically, I'm hoping it's going to just get a light polish and just get some of that out. So that's really important. So here's the actual mother's um, mag polish. So we'll take a little bit here just like a cream, and we're gonna put it on the uh, on the rag, and we're just gonna basically buff it in, do the whole thing. Let's get the whole thing like that. Let's go around the whole lens, and we wanna get the whole thing covered, okay? Like that, and you just wanna lightly, in circles, just buff it around. So what this does, hopefully it'll get some of that fog out, that pigmentation, that dirt and grime that builds into the lens over time and makes it foggy. And some people, some of them are really, really bad. And let's take a little bit more, okay? A little bit more on your, on your towel, on your rag, and just keep buffing it in there. Move it around like that, okay? Now, normally you will let this dry. So I'm gonna let it dry and then we're gonna buff it out. We're gonna see how that works. So that's one lens. We're gonna check it out. Let that dry up. Gonna cover this up. And basically we're just gonna buff it out. So I buffed it up really pretty good. You know, you, you have to do you know some, some elbow work in there, uh, elbow grease, but it does work. If you have a power drill or uh, some kind of buffer tool, it could be a lot easier, but I, you don't really have to kill yourself too much. It does work very well. Also want to apologize for that wire being in the shot a lot. I know it was annoying me when I'm editing this video, uh, and I do want to apologize for that. Uh, not cool. So I do apologize that hopefully it wasn't too distracting. I know it was distracting me when I was editing this video, so I do apologize for that. Um, but if the product does work, it does what it's supposed to do, and it really works awesome. All right, let's continue. Um, watching the video please don't forget to like share and subscribe it does help me and i appreciate that let's go well did a pretty good job i have to say not bad not bad at all it took a lot of it out a lot of it's gone here it's still a little bit on top so let's do another little application so it's not as simple as they showed it but it does work Put a little bit more on in the bad area right here I think you gotta buff it in personally. Because what you're doing is just removing that layer of bad plastic. So maybe if you had a buffing tool, it might go better. But we'll see. But it is doing what it said to do. I'll tell you, and for five or seven, I think it's like six bucks, seven bucks for that kind of money. It solves a big problem pretty quick. Alright. Let's get the dry side of the rag. And let's buff it out. Oh wow, 
That is perfect. Oh my God, that does work. It does work. Just like they said. Yep. You do have to work at it just a little bit, but it does get it out. I'm pretty shocked about that. Wow. I also have a terry cloth here. Let's see. There we go. Yeah, wow, that's pretty good, man. Wow. I'd say it took about 70% of that out on the first run. Definitely did, and you can see it's much shinier. Hopefully you can see. You can see it's like glass. It did a nice job. All right, let's see. Any questions or any comments, leave down below. And uh, hopefully I brought you some value, how to use something a little bit different. Let me get one more coat on the top here. I see just a little bit. Huge difference though, huge. Definitely did its job. I don't think, yeah, we, I wouldn't use compound on it because compound could be too rough. You could scratch it. This is more of a light polish. All right, cool. I like it. Well, it works, no question. For the money, you can't beat it. Huge difference. You can see that one there, and I'll show you the other one. This is the other one. So you can see this is a little bit uh, definitely foggier, not as clear in the glass. So you can see that. And then you can see this one, the difference. Big difference. Okay guys, that's it for me. As you can see, it does work. I'll leave a link down below. I tested it. I think it works perfectly. I'm gonna keep this around for a while. This is great for all kinds of things, but getting your headlights cleaned, Mothers does the job. All right, any questions, any comments, leave down below. I'll leave a link in the description where you can find this exact polish. Like I said, it's very inexpensive. It is a, a affiliate link. I do get a small commission that does help support my channel. And uh, I do appreciate that. If you, if you went ahead and did that, it'd be great. All right, guys, and I'll see you at the next review.